Madam Moderator, once more, I'm delighted to be able to report on the activities of our committee over the past year. As you may recall, the series is wholly supported by the Isaac Harris Carey Fund, I can never say that, set up by the Carey Sisters in 1921. Each year we are able to offer four free lectures to the citizens of Lexington. The committee thanks the, the fund trustees for their continued support of our efforts. We welcome two lecturers in the fall of 2023. The first, Saul Gittleman, spoke on Saturday, October 7th, on his newly published book, An Accidental Triumph, The Improbable History of American Higher Education. Dr. Gittleman, a professor emeritus and former provost at Tufts, drew a large, curious, and affectionate audience, since he's well known to many people in Lexington. Despite the unfortunate date, as it turned out, his talk included a fascinating history of higher ed in the US, and was filled with hope for the future of our universities. Little did we know then how prophetic and even more necessary his ideas would become. Our second speaker on Saturday, November 18th was Irene Lee, the powerhouse founder of May May Dumplings, which is based in the South End and includes a cafe, a factory and classrooms. Lee is not only a chef, but a businesswoman and activist, as her title suggests, cooking up dumplings, social justice, and sustainability. She was charming and ably interviewed by Meryl Lunen, one of the committee's new members. Again, there was a large turnout and the audience had many questions. As for the spring of 2024, those of you lucky enough to have attended the Saturday, March 9th, Carey Lecture, Jeff Leonard and Friends, will know that our beloved former music director from, from LHS, brought LHS alumni and college, coll colleagues to talk and share music in an exploration of the richly profound effects that music has on all of us, including those talented musicians who don't turn professional. Jeff Leonard himself has been a lifelong professional musician. His post LHS life includes teaching positions at Berkeley, BU, and the New England Conservatory of Music. Our final lecture on Saturday, April 12, 20th, will be Raj Chetty, Professor of Economics at Harvard. Although he's always been a prodigy, he's become extremely well known for the work he'll share with us under the title, Creating Equality of Opportunity in America, New Insights from Big Data. His studies of income inequality and inequality of opportunity are both granular and vast and he offers hope for real change in the future. This will be a contribution of great social significance. We already have our other our speakers lined up for fall 2024 and are working with other groups for the 250th celebrations in the spring of 2025. So please stay tuned. Our website is carrylectureseries.org, where you'll find all the relevant information. Please look out as always for our flyers, which should arrive shortly after Labor Day. They are no longer tickets, merely reminders. We send out regular announcements as well. And as I say every year, please attend our lectures. Our committee consists of Kevin Oye, Chair, Monica Galitzi, Meryl Lonen, Lunen, Omar, that's the Dutch pronunciation, Omar Kudari and me. We've recently had to say a sad goodbye to Maggie Pax and Bob Halpern, still much missed. We continue to thank the staff and volunteers at Lex Media for broadcasting lectures, the wonderful Laurie Lucibello at the Department of Public Facilities, and Catherine Severance at the Town Manager's Office. And again, a special round of applause to the superb staff at Cary Library, especially Matt Schumann, Helen Liu, and Corin Stembridge. The staff at Batten, at Batten Auditorium and Carey Hall, Kyle Walsh, Carl Trito, Andrew Zambella, Scott Donahue, and star technician Vince Leroux are models of patience and expertise, and we thank them from our hearts. Thank you.